If you're shooting a scene with more than one camera rolling at the same time, then the new multicam feature within LumaFusion can make your editing so much easier to do. Cheers. One of the ways this feature works is by analyzing the waveforms captured by each camera and using that to sync your clips together on the timeline. It means you can create an edit where you're able to seamlessly switch between different clips with just a few simple taps. Now this works great if we have clean audio from every clip on every camera that we're working with, but there are some things that can make it a little bit more difficult for LumaFusion to find the perfect match. First up, you might run into difficulties if you're stopping and starting your camera a lot because some of your clips might not have identifying audio, so try not to be too trigger happy on that record button. Secondly, it can be tough to sync your clips if you're in a really noisy atmosphere where there's a lot of unidentifiable audio. So things like a crowded restaurant, for example, or you're next to a chainsaw, or you're with lots of screaming babies. And lastly, it can be a bit tricky if you're recording audio with the same repeating sound again and again. Think about that chorus to your favorite song or perhaps automated train announcements. So stay away from those if possible. So those are some things to try and avoid. But if you're watching this now thinking, well, Caroline, I'll remember that for next time, but I've already shot my multicam masterpiece, then fear not, because luckily LumaFusion has ways you can manually fix the sync, which means you can get on with the switching much faster, which we all know is the fun part. First up, we have the audio method. Find a waveform that visually matches and then use these nudge buttons at the bottom of the synchronizer to fine tune the sync. If you have a bigger sync change to make, simply drag your clip into place. Secondly, we have the visual method. Find a visual moment you can identify on all angles, like a door closing or a hand clapping. Place your playhead on the action and then tap on the clip in each angle to align using the nudge buttons. When you're happy with the sync, press close and you're ready to switch. Give this a go guys, and if you have any questions at all, please do shoot them across. Until then, practice makes perfect. So grab your cameras and let's go do this.